Hi, and welcome back to Bourbon Blind, where the guys drink what y'all pick. So please feel free to leave a comment in the comment section or email me at bourbonblindtasting at gmail.com, and I'll try and get your bottle on the show as fast as humanly possible. Also, if you like our show, please feel free to hit that subscribe button. And if you've seen our show a bunch of times and, you know, you absolutely love us, go ahead and uh, visit our Patreon page where you can get all sorts of goodies, freebies, t-shirts. Head on over to the Patreon page if you love us. If not, keep watching. <laughs> I'd also like to say thanks to Sterling Cut Glass. They're the ones that put our lovely logos on uh, our glasses here. They do amazing work, so uh, go ahead and click right here if you would like to see their website. Also, Whiskey Creek Wholesale. They sell whole barrels for really reasonable prices. They actually brought us um, a couple barrels. We bought them, but they actually delivered them to us. So uh, they make awesome gifts. They also do some laser and Gretsch laser etching on the heads of barrels. Uh, we took some staves and made some really cool tasters. But yeah, go ahead and uh, click right here to uh, see their site. Um, with that being said, tonight's bottle comes from the Studley Group. Thank you very much for emailing us. They requested this bottle, and as always, the guys don't know what they're drinking, so I'm not going to say what it is, but they're going to tell you what they think of it without the hype of that label, because we all know when we purchase something that's mm, a little more pricey, we expect it to taste better, but that's not always the case we found out from uh, Blind Tastings. What's up guys, welcome back to Bourbon Blind. I'm Kyle. And I'm Frank. We taste whiskey, we don't know what it is. We give you a price we'd be willing to pay for a bottle without the hype of the label. Let's get in here. Sweetness. Yep. Sweetness on the nose. Not, not a lot of heat in my opinion. Kind of light color. And it's pretty light in smell, but sweet. Yep. Yeah, it's lighter bourbon, not dark. Not a whole lot going on in there, but it is pleasant. It is. Like a traditional bourbon. Yeah. I mean, everything there that should be and nothing, yep, nothing not much else. Yep. You know what I mean? Little spice. Mm -hmm. Maybe a little bit of cherry on that back end. I agree. Yeah. Cheers, guys. Let's try it. Cheers. Sir? More of that vanilla. Yep. Following through. A little bit of spice on the back end. A little spice. Not too sweet. Just no. Just a little bit. Yep. Yep. A little bit of sweetness. A little bit of spice. Fairly well balanced, but again, not, I don't, not, not, not a whole lot. Not a lot of heat. Not a, not a lot of proof on there. It's not too high proof. It's, it tastes kind of like a 95 proof, 100 proof. Yeah. Maybe. Maybe like 90. Yeah, it's 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 light. It's, mm -hmm. Yeah, I have a feeling when we add water to this, it's gonna kick it down quite a bit. Yep. If, it, if it's not a you know hundred proof yeah. or above, but it tastes good. It does. It's tasty. I said, there's nothing off putting about it. Nope. There's no garbage can or yep. wet dog smell. Yep. So <laughs> it's it's also not it's not like overwhelmingly like like good. I'm not like blown away. Right. Right. Yeah. Just, like I said, it's. It it is what a bourbon should be, and yeah. nothing yeah. nothing more. Totally. You're just more of that caramel. Yep. Following through. Legs are running pretty quick. But it, it's Oops. it's not bad. No. It just no no not at all. Let's try it with some add. water. Let's do that. You want a couple drops? Yeah, please. Perfect. Thank you. It actually didn't do a whole lot to the nose for me. Mm -mm. It didn't really change Agreed. it. Didn't really change it much. It smells pretty much the same. I think the smell and the heat is somewhat the same in the nose. Yeah. I like it better without it, water. I think it watered it down some. It did. Kind of killed. Nothing's nothing's like opened up with that at no, all. With the water. Nothing opened up. It kind of muted stuff a little it bit. Did. And yeah. 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 With the water. Mm -hmm. Eh. 
but I definitely prefer it without water. It's got a little, it's definitely sweeter right. without the water. Get the more heat without the water, but it's not bad. I'm sorry, guys. I mean, there's just not yeah. not a lot going on in here. There's not. You know what I mean? Like, it's it's good. It's not off-putting, but right. there's no Hope like, I'm not layers, be disappointed. like layers and depth <laughs> of flavor. There's not. Yeah. You know what I mean? I mean, it's... Mm -mm. So back to the untainted sample, and it's got a fairly rich mouthfeel. Not not super oily, but it's not off-putting. It's not dry. Without the water, you're definitely getting more of that heat. What it originally had, but it's... Uh, I'm... Just, it's a little sweet, but it's... It's not bad. I'm... If yeah. I'm gonna drink that neat, I'm gonna drink it like that without water. Um, yeah. Just a regular bourbon to me, in my opinion. Yeah. Um. It's. Yeah, like you said, it, it it it's a bourbon. It's. I'm assuming. I mean, it, it could be a rye, it but I don't think so. It could be a rye. So. It doesn't taste like a rye, but mm -mm. it could be. Um. Yeah. I mean, there's just not not a lot going on. Yeah. I'm at. Do you have a price in mind? For this. Um. I mean, I. I'm at 20, that. I'm at like twenty bucks. I was gonna so say it's, thirty to forty max yeah, for me. Yeah, and not even for me. I, I think it's just something where I go in, I buy a bourbon that I haven't tried before, and I'm paying twenty bucks for it. Maybe right. somebody said it's decent, like it's it's a decent drinker, <laughs> and that's what I got out of it. So hopefully, I'm not gonna be super like, disappointed. <laughs> yeah, but twenty bucks for me is what I pay for that. Yeah, so. I'm, I'm at like I said, thirty to forty. Okay, max. Okay, and. So, anyway, you're new. You want to do the uh, Yeah, I'm actually the very curious what it's going to be. Let's see. Let's get this guy open. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> that, that does make sense. That makes sense. Wild Turkey wow. Long Branch. And I, I like Wild Turkey. I'm a huge... I like the regular Wild Turkey. Mm -hmm. What is it? The 101? The 101, yep. Yeah, it's, Russell's Reserve. Like, I could, like, I, the 101 tastes better than it. Oh yeah, so, hands um, down. Yeah, hands yeah. down. Like it's got more flavor. It's got a little more heat. Whereas, it's just got a better overall flavor. Mm -hmm. A little sweeter too. More depth of yeah. flavor. More complex. Totally. Um, but yeah, I'd pay twenty bucks for that bottle. In um, my opinion, I think that this retails for like forty bucks. Okay. Which I've I've said before, it's. It, I think it's overpriced for what it is. Um, but on the other hand, like if you. If your favorite profile is stuff that is light and easy to drink, um, you know, take like a like an off-the-shelf Blanton's, right. for example. You know what I mean? Like, yep. this is a lot easier to find for. Oh, I know, would agree. Thirty bucks less than yeah, Blanton's, totally. and I'd be a lot happier with this, honestly. Than a Blanton's. But, yeah, I um, love Blanton's, but that's, I do too. But yeah. I think I think it's getting too expensive for, for yeah. what it is. But. Um, yeah, and this is, I think, 86 proof? Yeah, 43% 86 proof. 86, which, yeah. I said 95-ish, roughly. Yeah, so, 90. Yeah. So It's low. It's mm -hmm. yeah. just um, a regular bourbon. It's got a good mouthfeel. Yeah. There's, like I said, there's nothing off-putting about yeah. it. So, yeah. Agreed. I mean, it it does have the wild turkey taste. But, mm -hmm. but, but like we said, like, I would take the 101 over this. Any day of the week. In a heartbeat. Any day. Yeah. And I'd probably pay... Of course, I'd take... Doing a blind more. tasting on that, I'd probably pay more than what it retails for. Right. So... Um, and... Of course, I'd take the 101 over a lot of bourbons I, in that price I range. I completely agree with that. <laughs> yeah. Totally. Oh, yeah. So... Yeah. All right. Well, I mean... Cool. Appreciate it, Frank. <laughs> of course. <laughs> Thanks for having me. I appreciate it. Until next week, guys. Friday, noon central. Drink blind. Drink blind.